Hello students, today I am going to explain the flying vowels activity. To complete this activity, you need all of the items that you see here. You need your ICANN card, you need your recording sheet, you need the cards that have your short and long letters on them, and you need the baggie full of words. First thing you need to do to complete this activity is to read your ICANN card. This card says I can one, read the word on the bow and determine the vowel sound. Two, place the bow on the kite with the correct vowel sound. Three, write the word next to the correct vowel sound on my recording sheet. Next thing you are going to do is you are going to spread out your vowel kites that have the long and short vowel, set, vowel letters on them. Once that is completed, you're gonna take the bows with the words on them and you are going to deal those out to the other students in your group working with you. So let's say we have four students working together. We're gonna spread these out into four different groups. We're gonna deal them out to make sure everyone gets the same number of cards. Like so. Then each student is going to take their group of cards and you are going to read the words on them and you are going to place them on the correct kite. And there will be two words for each kite. So this first word I'm looking at, I need to stretch it out and read it, is tune, toon. And this is a long vowel. The E is silent and it makes that U say its name, so toon. Tune, so I'm gonna put that under the long U, on the long U tent, like so. Then I'm gonna continue doing that. I'm gonna look at my next word, which is feet. Feet. So that's a long E sound, so I'm gonna put that on my, my E kite, and I'm gonna continue doing that. Again, remember, you will have two bows on each kite. Continue doing that until you get all of the bows on the kites. As you complete this activity, you are listening for short or long vowel sounds and you're matching those up. Once you have all your bows on your kites, you are ready to start your recording sheet. Don't forget to put your name on the top of your recording sheet. Then on your sheet here, you're going to write the two words that go with either the long or short vowel sound on the correct lines. So I'm going to look at this U that I did. I did this long U and I had the word tune. So I am going to find my long U kite, which is right here, and I'm going to write on my first line, I'm going to write the word tune in lowercase letters. T-U-N-E. Tune. I am going to continue that until I have my entire recording sheet completed. Once I get that done, I will turn in my recording sheet, clean up all the materials, and you are ready to move on to your next activity.